coronavirus continues to evolve and new symptoms are still being linked to the virus. Some symptoms that you really wouldn't expect. News 5's Cherish Lombard joins us live from her home to tell us what to look for. Cherish? Purple toes and fingertips. The condition is being referred to as COVID toes. Doctors haven't seen a lot of cases reported from older people, but like large vessel strokes, COVID toes is another coronavirus symptom showing up in younger adults and also in children. Another new symptom of the coronavirus, lesions that suddenly appear on one toe or all of them, or even just somewhere on the top or bottom of your feet. They can begin as bright red, then become purple. Dr. Fred Bodie, a dermatologist with USA Health, says in rare cases, the lesions can even appear on the fingertips. They'll just be sitting at home and they'll look down and their toes will be purple, or their, um, their hand, fingers might, a couple of their fingers. Dr. Bodie believes the condition is due to inflammation inside the blood vessels caused by COVID. Probably due to microemboli, a little blood clots in the teeny tiny vessels of the fingers and the toes. And it creates a, 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 just a sort of a vasculitis, a purple looking color, and it kind of self, uh, it self goes away. COVID toes lesions can be itchy and painful, and the patients may only have one or two other symptoms of COVID-19 or no other symptoms. And they might have sniffles or a sore throat uh, or something, and they might not think anything about it because a lot of people have COVID and don't even know they have it. If blisters accompany the purple color, you should be aware that if they pop, those blisters can likely spread coronavirus. Chicken pox spreads through the blisters, absolutely. That's a viral flu, fluids, viruses are in that fluid of the blisters uh, and chicken pox. So I would assume until proven otherwise that it would be infectious. Cases of COVID toes are being seen primarily in larger cities, but Dr. Bodie says that doesn't mean that it can't happen closer to home. I think a lot of this stuff we just don't know yet. The whole disease is evolving as we're getting more and more information about it. Dr. Bodie says it's important to remember not to panic if your toes or possibly fingertips turn purple. Instead, call your doctor, let them know, and he says you shouldn't be afraid to go to their office or a hospital if they tell you to. Cherish Lombard, WKRG News 5.